my room. This is where I live at Emory University. I just wanted to make a video, so here's what I'm gonna do. I am going to go about doing the things I do and film them. I need to fold some laundry, and then I'm gonna walk over to main campus and go to water polo practice. So here I am folding my clothes. Low key, I kind of feel like I spend my entire life just sort of cleaning up the same like three square feet of my room over and over again, but that's okay, whatever. Anyway, I don't do laundry often enough, so maybe that's why. Uh, anyway, here's my closet. This is where I keep my laundry because otherwise my room starts to smell bad because I don't know, I guess I sweat or something. And here's me putting away my clean clothes. I like those, I don't know. I have a lot of pairs of pants this semester for some reason. Not really sure why I brought so many pants. Here's a sweater. I got this thing in Ecuador, actually. I really like that sweater. And here's my cleaned up room. Haha, -ha, see, I did it. That's the messy spot that I never clean up because that's where I throw all my shit. But other than that, it looks pretty good, I think. So now I'm heading over to water polo practice. I'm on the club water polo team here. Not something I ever really planned to be on when I started college, but I went to the club fair my freshman year and the girls at the booth were nice to me. So I just went to the first practice and now it's four years later and I'm still doing it. So that's cool, I guess. This is my car. I keep it in the garage over here, but I never drive over to main campus except in the evenings and on the weekend because you have to pay and I don't want to pay to do that. I guess you can get a parking pass to park on main campus too, but I don't have one. It's fine, it doesn't matter. There's a shuttle you can take over there. Anyway, so here's me driving over. I promise I didn't like actually film while I was driving. I just sort of propped up the camera on my boobs in like a way on my sweatshirt. So don't worry, I'm being safe. Um, there you can see the Emory sign. There's Emory signs all over the place in this area to sort of like lead you on the actual roads to campus. It only takes about like eight minutes to drive there from my place. Um, because, but, and it's only that because you have to sort of go out and around. I love Emory's campus. This is right on Emory's campus now. It's so pretty. This road that you see here is where a lot of the underclassmen live and also it's where a lot of the frat houses are and things like that. Um, anyway, there's a parking garage on the road too and it's right by the gym. So I parked right in there, um, and just sort of like walked through kind of a nice garage I guess it's usually full I wish that they let me park there anyway this is walking up to the gym there's one of the houses on that road that I was mentioning I don't know if that's a frat house or something else honestly not sure um, this is called the woodpeck it's the largest sort of athletic facility at Emory there's a bunch of other ones but this is the one with the pool and all that stuff see so you can see it says PE center um, right there anyway so inside here you just sort of swipe your card in um, just like I'm doing here, uh, your student ID gets you in pretty much into any building and there is the pool. That's where I'm headed. Uh, we play water polo there. Usually there is an outdoor pool on the other Claremont campus that we go to sometimes, but mostly we just do it here. Um, Can I have a towel please? Yeah, so you can get a towel though. You have to do a scan your card and you just get a towel that they then wash for you. It's pretty nice. and. Here's the dressing room. It's nice. I didn't actually show much in there because obviously people dressing. Um, and here's the pool. You can see Club Swim off to the left there was practicing. They practiced right before us. And there's all Emery's records and stuff. Aww. <laughs> Are you taking videos? Oh yeah. Gotta record. Anyway, then we actually played water polo for two hours, but I didn't record any of that because I was sopping wet and they say my phone is waterproof, but I don't actually believe that it is waterproof. Uh, I don't know, maybe it is. I, I don't trust it. One of the girls on the team always plays with her Apple watch on, but I'm too chicken shit to ever do that. Um, I don't know. And then here's me and one of the other girls diving. This is the three meter board, so obviously I'm terrified. I think this is the first time I'd ever did, dove in off one. Um, yeah, I survived. I don't know. I did it again the following practice too, actually, so I'm not too upset. Then I drove home and I actually took one of the other girls home too. And that was the end of my day.